Hi everybody, this is Mickey Adams in Dallas, Texas. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Glad to see you here with your pedal steel. What I'd like to share with you in this lesson is simply an exercise that I created very early on in my practice in my early 20s. Uh, it's based on a major scale and it also has some pedal bends in there, but it improved my dexterity, it improved my coordination, all the other things that I've been harping about in all my lessons. I am an advocate of exercise. Just like an Olympic weightlifter has to lift weights for years and years and years before he's ever going to compete in the Olympics. The same with the pedal steel. Man, this is a, a monumental task being really, really proficient at the pedal steel guitar. And a lot of it is based on coordination. Now, with an electric guitar, you have your left hand and your fingers. With a pedal steel guitar, these are your feet, right? So coordination between the right hand and the picks and the feet is paramount. So I developed this simple, basic major scale exercise and began getting faster and faster and faster. My pick blocking improved, my dexterity improved, my ear improved. I still use this one to this day. As a matter of fact, this morning when I sat down, I just started noodling around with my exercises and I came upon this one. I thought, well, maybe they'd want to see it. So if this is going to work for you, you let me know. You guys post the comments because, I mean, all your negative ones I can delete anyway, so. <laughs> Let's look at a straight major scale, and it's not necessarily uh, 24 notes. Uh, I'm actually going to cut it short. It's actually going to stop at a fifth at the top, but let's look at... Now, I'm in one position. I have my A and B pedals down now, so let's go 8, 7, 6, B... 5A, 1, 4. The next three notes are, and that is 1, 3, B. 8, 7, 6, B, 5, A, 2, 4, 1, 3, B. Everybody got that? Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to utilize this pedal bend. This is 5-4. Five, 5-4. Four. Five, four. A. Now I'm going to incorporate this in a major scale. And then 5. 6 with B. Release, seven, eight. Now the exercise sounds like this. I'm sure you get the picture here. Now, this is the key of A. Now, if I drop this, second string a half step it'll become a D major and we can end it a little bit differently but all the notes are still diatonic to the four chord so here we have a but it's also D I'm gonna drop the second string it would end on a D note and it would sound like this What is this doing? You're coordinating your right hand with your pedals, striking a string, activating it, releasing it, striking the next note. And this is where the hand-to-eye coordination comes in. This is a simple exercise that I honestly do believe will improve your dexterity. I thank you all so much for tuning in and your comments. This is Mickey Adams. We'll see you right back here with your pedal steel.